Thanks, Connor. There's a girl outside Tulsa, Oklahoma, who may not be the oldest or the youngest person to compete in the Scripps National Spelling Bee, but she has arguably worked the hardest to get there. Here's Shaq Shackelford with a buzz on making it to the B. Nephilognosy. How do you spell stress? S T R E S S. The Scripps National Spelling Bee. These students are the A listers of B's. You've got to see. Symmetrical. Yes. I'm not as nervous. But seeing is the one extra hurdle for sixth grader Rochelle Zampella of Muskogee, Oklahoma. She is blind and studies in Braille. It's real easy just to scan and look at words at, down the page, but she actually has to feel all the Braille dots. We caught up with Rochelle hard at work just weeks after winning the State B for a second year. And when I heard her spell that word. L-E-I-N-E, Fraulein. Incorrect. I was like, it's my chance, I can win it now. She has a coach, English professor Bridget Beaver, who has donated her time to help her bring home the title. I bet I won't get this right. I think you will. Just hoping I'm randomly selecting some of the ones that you know she might encounter. She studies during breaks at the Oklahoma School for the Blind, after school and on weekends. This would make me a nervous wreck. This would make me a nervous wreck. <laughs> she can spell words, but doesn't mince them. This time I want you to pick words that you do know so I'll know what you're saying. <laughs> <laughs> She's talking trash. So how do you train to compete? against 281 of the very best spellers. Study hard, have fun, and don't be nervous. In that order? <laughs> well, they, they can be in any order, but you have to study first. She may have to study differently than the rest, but if she acts at the B like she does at home, she will get the last word. Okay, I'll go slower. B, A. For The List, I'm Shaq Shackleford.